Welcome. I see you there. You've come to see your loved ones again, haven't you? That's what brings you to my realm. Well, I shouldn't say my realm, should I? Seeing as they don't appear to listen to anything that I tell them to. Oh, you haven't seen anything yet. My, my, you have got a lot to learn. Please, come closer. I won't bite. I'm here to help you in a way. You see, I help others along their way. I know, by the look on your face, I obviously don't need to explain how much of a bore this job is. I'm sorry, I haven't introduced myself yet. My name is Alexander. I'm a watcher. My job is to watch people and the horrific events that they call a life, which I promptly catalog and, at a certain appointed time, must lead a victim through their past terrors to teach them a lesson. You're not in hell. You're somewhere much worse. At least life in hell is simple. Torture, agony, blood and tears. However, here you are not dead, nor are you to be tortured. But if you misbehave and don't do exactly as I say, I can't help but only watch while the wisps which stalk these paths take you for their sport. Your job is simple. You walk down this alleyway of horrors, and every once in a while you will come across almost a tale or at least a memory of an unfortunate victim of one of my colleagues. Doesn't sound that bad, does it? Remember. You're blessed to be in my company. No spell or incantation has brought you here. I chose you. Sleep is a precious thing. Don't waste it on wide-mouthed killers and ghouls wearing three-piece suits. The time has literally come to test your nerve. If you fail, my friends will take you off my hands. You've actually brought yourself here, being terrified of almost anything, reading all those stories and tales sourced from a child's mind and phobias. Being inhibited by life itself, you look up into the night sky and tremble with fear that by some rejection of physics, you'll find yourself floating into the darkness and solitude of the stars. So be bold and brave, and may you survive the path I have set for you. Now, let me tell you a story. <laughs>